Hello, I hope this video finds you well. Tonight we're going to look at sort of sum from logic one, and this is a Java solution. Problem states given two ints a and b return their sum. However, sums in the range 10 to 19 inclusive are forbidden. So in that case, just return 20. So the example is 3, 4 gives us 7, which is fine. 9, 4 is 13, which falls within that range of 10 to 19. So we return 20. 10, 11 is outside that range, so we return 21. So we see here's our header, we have two integers, and, you know, let's just start off by saying return a plus b. So that's going to return the sum, which is obviously not right in all the cases because of these situations where we have, are between 10 and 19 inclusive. So what we do, as opposed to just returning the sum right away, we're going to make an int called sum. And then before we return it, we're going to do a check, and we're going to say if sum is greater than or equal to 10, and, oh, that's Python, <laughs> sum is less than or equal to 19. Well, in that case, we're going to return 20, because this is how we check if it's within that range. If sum is greater than or equal to 10 and less than or equal to 19, it's within that range inclusive. We return 20. Otherwise, we return sum. Now, I want to hit go. There's an error here, and I want you to really understand how to read this. This says missing return statement. This is something that's different compared to Python. If you ran this in Python, it would still run because Python doesn't require a return statement, however Java does. Since there's a return statement inside the if statement, but there isn't one outside of it, Java recognizes that it might not reach a return. And that is, when you get this error, that's what it means. It means that there is some situation that you won't reach a return statement. So all I have to do here is say return sum and hit go. And there it is. I hope that video helped. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. Have a great day.